A pay what you can cafe in North Charleston is closing down, and that's because of the property management raising rent. Too bad to hear this. News 2's Lexi Moore had a chance to talk to the woman who owns Destiny Community Cafe. It would have been seven years, y'all, this Easter. We would have been celebrating seven years right here. Destiny Community Cafe, built off philosophy, prepping and serving the low country community thousands of meals. But now the cafe closing their doors and packing boxes as high charges of rent stand in the way. We won't be here anymore. Well, where are these people going to eat? Regina Scott Saunders says her property management company is upping her rent at Destiny Community Cafe to $10,000 and attempts to invest into the area and put bars and restaurants where her business currently is. There were nine small businesses here. Nine. Half of them had had to leave because of this rent increase that they're doing. Scott Saunders says she got a letter from her property manager on October 1st saying she has to leave by October 31st if she can't pay the new rent fee. And she says she can't afford these high prices. We tried to negotiate and talk to them. The only thing they try to give me and push contracts in my face and ask me to sign it without reading it. As Scott Saunders packs up years of hard work and service, she says the way she is getting through this difficult time is looking forward and starting a food truck. Keep hope lift my head up and say goodbye, but say hello to, you know, a good future. And now we'll remember the impact the cafe has left in thousands of lives. I told people, you know, they don't realize, you know, we don't get to tell folks a lot. We had folks that would come here that was in suicidal states, but they left here not wanting, wanting to live because somebody cared. Lexi Moore reporting, we have reached out to the property manager for any type of comment, but so far have not heard back.